Mic check, mic check. We up in this. Coming to you live. In the sold out arena. We have the first Polish qualifier. Featuring Team 1 and Team 2. Oh man. Oh, statue with the lag fake out. Alright, so the two teams we are working with. Team pulling number one is Diesel, Morvin, Statue, and Foggy. Four member squad versus number two, which would be Mayhem, Pure, Kook, of Fame, Axer, and Horn. Should be a good one whenever uh, people want to show up. It is a classic playoff format. Each team will choose two maps. Oh, here comes the gang, gang, gang rolling in. The big guns. The masters of this Polish 2D shooter. Straight out of Poland.
So pull in one first pick is going to be Ice Beam up in it. Brat. Uh, for those at home, the only real difference between this and the playoffs is the uh, opponents pick the side on the map, which makes it a little interesting for certain maps like Blade. So anyway, first map we got from Poland Numero Uno will be Ice Beam. Looks like it's just going to be Diesel, Statue, and Morvin for every map since their fourth member, uh, Foggy, is not in the server. Seems we are having uh, some difficulty choosing maps. A couple of new players here, uh, they don't know the map list. Just kidding, I don't know why they do not know yet. We're just waiting, sitting, waiting, wishing, hoping, praying, thinking, drinking, you know, the usual. But in the meantime, we'll watch Horn. Ooh, nice. Ooh, nice, ooh. Ni oh, no, not nice. Wait, let's watch statue. Oh, so they picked Spark for the first map for Poland 2, Wretch the second map, and then Triumph. Ice Beam, Spark, Wretch, Triumph. Alright, game on. Bear with us. More of an AFK. Tactical AFK start just to see what's happening. I'll tell you what's happening. Kuka and Fame are going top. Horn's going low. The rest is history. Alright, Morvin, third time's a charm. Here we go. Alright, 
Diesel going low fast. Let's take a quick look. Oh, they both pass each other. Horn doesn't even see him. Oh my gosh, Diesel just walks into the base. Bad communication is going to be a first cap for pulling numero uno, most likely. Horn's still trying to defend it, but Diesel's going to get the flag. One to zero. Oh, statue getting the flag there too. Two to zero. Quick double cap. Make it a triple cap? Nope. Fame clears base. Oh! Jesus Christ, it's going quick. Flags on the stand should be a cap for pulling. Number two. Horn, 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 horn. Alright, we're in. Alright. Statue coming top of the spaz. Horn clears him. Two top coming up now for pulling two as a chance to make some pressure. Horn gets one. Not the second. Morvan clears it out. Kuka takes care of diesel low. Oh, diesel's looking to go top there, but it's a turn back. Take care of Kuka. Oh, statue getting the flag. Cheese and rice. Can't even keep track. Horn's going to get the return, though. No! Great knife from Morvan. There's a chance here. Fame, gonna throw it. Diesel's right there though. Diesel gets the return. Uh, Fame's gonna get the return. Install. Oh, the nade kills him. Alright, let's take a deep breath. Two to one, minute and a half in. Fame gets one. Morvan coming in quick. He's got a knife chance. Misses it. Horn's gonna take care of him, but Diesel's here. Cuckoo with a nice knife as well. Alright, two coming in now for pulling one. More of a statue, he's got a great chance. Fame takes care of him. Oh, Kuka getting the flag. It's a nice toss. It's going to be 2-2. Two to two. Great action early. Oh, Jesus Christ. The low route. Diesel getting the flag now. It's going to be 3-2. to two. Can't even keep track. Alright, two coming in top now. Statue gets one. Morvan gets the flag. Nice toss. Should be a cap. Statue is going to get the flag. Making it 4-2. to two, Just two and a half minutes into the match. Diesel takes care of Kuka low. He's going to come in quickly as he is wont to do. Kuka takes care of them though. Alright, here comes Horn and Statue battling top. Horn takes care of him. Kuka's going to get the flag. Nice throw. Pulling two needs this cap. They can't let that flag get returned. Kuka. Oh! Fortunately, there's no one coming into base, so they will get the cap. Kuka with it. Making it four to three. Kuka coming in here has a chance against Diesel. Takes care of him, but he's going to have to go back and get health. And here comes pulling one from the top. Morvan just holding it. Good chance for a flag throw. He's going to get it off. Yep. Should be a cap. Nice toss. Horn's going to sit mid. Try to throw some nades at it, but don't think it'll do much. Nope. Morvan with a nice throw. And the clear base. It's going to be a cap. Five to three. Six minutes left still. Classic Ice Beam, high scoring, everyone loves it. Sakablat. What? No one knows what that means. Taking a quick look. Kills are fairly even. Uh, Morvan doing the heavy work early for Poland, numero uno. Which is pulling number one, if y'all didn't know at home. Statue leaving, stat reset, smart move, you never know. And we're back. Fame with the kill top, he's gonna come in. Has a chance here, gets a knife. Oh, if you can get more in here, nope. But Horn? Horn's gonna have a weak chance for a double. Nade spam. 
Get some? Nope. Oh, here comes fame. Oh, nice knife from statue. First kill of the map for those wondering at home. <laughs> just kidding, he just left and rejoined. Alright, here comes pulling number one now with a rush. Horn takes care of him. Kuka coming in from low. Oh, he just misses the flag. Diesel with a nice quick knife. Oh, Kuka! Oh no, this low battle! <laughs> Diesel's got a chance to come in to see if the other team turns back. Yes, Horn takes care of him. Horn with a nice double kill, but Morvan cleans him out. He's gonna rush in top. Should get taken care of. Diesel coming in low, full health. Gets him once. He's still weak, though. He's gonna get health. Fame coming in fast, survives, gets health. Good chance for a 2v1 rush right here. Oh, Morvan. Oh, the nade. The knife, deek, intentional miss to lead him into the nades. You could tell, you could see. Okay, here comes Tetshira. No, nice nade from Horn. Kuka coming in low now, gets taken care of by Diesel. Horn, Horn, nope. Kuka versus Diesel low here. Kuka takes care of him. Gotten a little bit of a stalemate here. Hasn't been a cap in a couple minutes. Four minutes to go now. Ooh, Fame almost with a pretty knife, but Statue just dodges it. Now they're coming in quick. Statue gets one kill. Morvin? Morvin? He's weak? That's gonna get you flag though. Yep. Nice toss. Cap makes it 6-3. Mormon takes care of Horn with a knife. Oh, that's going to be another one. Let's see if Kuku can defend it. Nope, it gets by him just barely, but a lot of nades coming. Could get blown back? No, it sticks. Morvan's going to get the cap, make it 7 3. Chance for a double? Nope. Alright, pretty commanding lead now. Only three minutes to go. 7 3 in the first map of this pre qualifier between two of the three Poland teams. Know what you're thinking? Well, Chile had six teams, so what's up? I just don't know. I don't know what to tell you guys. Diesel's gonna get the flag there. Misses the boost. Horn takes him out. Morvan, 41 and 30, doing a great job top. Almost feels like an automatic double kill with that HK. And right on Q, there's another one. He's gonna get the flag. Yep. Bad spawn for Poland two. Flag toss the statue. We are eight to three. Two and a half minutes to go. I think you can put this one in the books, folks. The second map will be Spark. Oh, hey, there's a Constellation one. Kuka to fame. Misses it, gets it, misses it, gets it. 8-4. Alright, Diesel going to go back and get health low. Looking top, Horn cleans one. Morvin, though, takes care of him. Kuka with a nice nade, but doesn't kill him, and a nice knife out of the knife gets him after a nade, finishes him off. Morvan's still alive. Going big. Going huge, as some would say. Alright. Takes care of each other there. Fame coming against Statue right now. Nade to the feet, you're done. Horn checking low, getting run up on Statue. Statue and Morvan have another good chance here. Nice knife, and Morvan gets one. Oh, now here comes Diesel. Flag throw. Perfect. Oh, no! The flag, just teasing. Nice throw from Morvan to Statue to make it 9-4. to four. And Diesel's still alive, but doesn't have enough arm power or willpower to make the throw. So, 9-4, to four, minute left. We'll call this good, prepare for Spark. But I'm sure Poland... Numero Uno wants that 10th cap just to kind of be like, all right, boys, here's what you're up against. Fame? Nope, gets taken out by Morvan, who's got a big 53 kills. If they don't get 10 caps, he might put up 60. It's always exciting. 60 just seems like that number that, like, oh, all of a sudden they're pretty good. Kuka, though, can get a flag toss. Bad flag toss, but 
but it'll work. The base is cleared out. Nine to five. Diesel coming in hot quick. Fame and Horn top. Morvin gets one. 56 kills. Diesel is flag toss. This should be a good game. Morvin misses it. I'm Morvin, I'm not capping. I want 60. Don't do it. Don't do it. Ah, uh, he did it. 10 to five on the first map. Pulling number one with the victory. All right, next up, we've got Spark. The knife only turned into weirdly very popular map where it's about as straightforward as it gets. You just click, spray, hold, and pray. And uh, see if someone can make a play. <laughs> it's going to be a great day, boys. Kuka, Pier, Mayhem, the Oxid lineup. Foggy coming in. For Diesel, so it'll be more of a statue and Foggy now. He of the yellow pants. Yes, you heard me right. It'll be interesting to see if uh, Poland 2 can handle the speed of statue and his spaz, because you know he will be going quick. And here we go. Here with the spaz, statue with the spaz. Got some Polish stuff being written that I don't know, but uh, I'm sure it's important, so we're not going. Alright, Foggy disconnected. Classic strat. You always want to disconnect right before the match just to kind of see what their strategy is, make them nervous, make them sweat a little bit. We learned that one back in 2006, uh, for those at home that want a little history lesson. Tactical disconnect. Ooh, Pier, good toss, good preparation, spaz on spaz, crime, whew, hide your kids. Alright, Foggy has returned. Once again, we got Statue, Foggy, Morvin versus Mayhem, Pier, Kuka. One map lead for the team led by statue in this pre qualification mumbo jumbo all right here we go first rush it looks like pierce switched to an auto so they can go three autos for the alpha side, two autos and a spaz for Bravo. Statue with a nice kill quick. No flag throw though. Kuka has a good chance here if he can get a med kit. He does. And a chance for a throw, but no, he goes right at him. Interesting strategy and it did not work out. Everyone's killed each other. I think you've seen more and more teams trying to get the uh, health kits out of their base as soon as possible because it gets a lot harder to cap if you don't have health to grab. As you'll see right here with... Oh! Pierce still alive. Statue though. Gonna go at him. Just needs to hit him once I think. Yep. Takes care of him. Ooh, first flag toss low. Statue's alive. He's going to get rid of it. And there he goes. He's quick. He's fast. He's a bird. He's a plane. He's a Polish sold out player. One to zero. A minute and a half in. Statue leading in kills and has the lone cap for Poland number one. Nice nade there to take care of Kuka. And we all know one cap is usually not enough to win on Spark here. Get a little chaos going. Mayhem's going to come in fast. No health kits, though. 
Statue just lines them up, knocks them down. No, nope, Kuka's gonna get out. Nice flag toss. Oh no, miscommunication. Mayhem goes low. Statue with another kill. Oh, but Pierre has a chance to get out. Nope, Foggy takes care of him. Kuka with a nice throw. Mayhem, is he going to get out? No, Morvan cleans it up with a clutch double kill. Morvan takes care of him low. Exchanging deaths now. No team's had that great of an opportunity outside of the actual cap. Pierre's gonna kill Foggy and Morvan. Statue coming in low with the spaz. Nice knife from Pierre to clean him. Cleanse his soul, if you will. Alright, all three of o Team Oxid Poland. Nope. Here comes Foggy. Oh no, the nade takes care of him. Statue's weak, no health. See, that's why health is so huge if you can get into their base with health kits. Alright, double rush low right now. Let's see if anyone can survive. Kuka's still alive, but he's very weak. Morvan takes care of one. Pierre's gonna get the flag. See if he can make a throw. See if he can make a throw. Oh gosh, they're just gonna roll right onto him. All right, four minutes to go. Still one to zero. Oxid uh, Poland actually with a slight KD advantage. 63 kills to 61. Otherwise, it is very even. But Poland won with the early lead. Morvan, nice toss to statues. You gonna get out? Oh, he's fast. He's fast. He's fast. A nice throw. This could get returned though. Nope. Everyone gets killed. Morvan with a cap. Two zero. Two zero feels a lot better than one zero. I'll tell you. I'll tell you what. Oh, nice law from Foggy. The ricochet into Mayhem's mouth. Foggy's gonna come in quick. Oh, the nice nade bounce, but it doesn't look like it hurts him. Nice knife from Kuka to take care of him. Here's a fast rush from Statue. See if he can get into the base. Nice nade. Get a health kit. Gets a double kill. Gets the health. <gasps> He's got a chance to see the flag throw. Oh no, the flag throw falls short. Oof. You do everything right, and then you just poop down your leg. It happens. All right, here we go. Two to zero. Five minutes left. Kuka has a first chance. Everyone's dead. Oh, he throws it. Morvan's still alive in the base. Mayhem! No, you gotta make the throw. Statue with the Ruger switch gets a double kill. Knife from Kuka takes it out, but they get the all important return. Two to zero still. Foggy's gonna have the flag here with a wealth of health kits. He can stay alive. Nope, Pierre gets the return. Morvan's gonna have a chance here. Nice lost shot to take care of Kuka. Pierre very weak. This is a double kill waiting to happen. Statue gets one, but he gets taken out. Four minutes left. Two to zero still for Poland team one, who also won the first map. A win here will give them a very commanding lead in the best of four. Statue moving too fast, can't get the health, but if he gets it here, it could be GG. Nope, Pierre's nade kills him. And they take care of him. They're still alive by the skin of their teeth. Statue of the double kill. Morvan coming in very weak. One hit. One little bullet. It's all we need. He's dead. Okay. Alright, all three alphas attacking now, but two are very weak. It's going to make it tough. Morvan has a chance to get in. Taken care of, though. Statue? Nope. Oh. Kuka has a chance here, but he needs that last kill. Nope. Mayhem gonna try to come around them, but he's also weak. Statue has a great chance here to get the flag, and he's gonna be full health. Oh, but the nade again. Good clear from Alpha. 
Poland Team 2, for those wondering at home. Three minutes to go, still 2-0 to zero in favor of Poland Team 1, who won the first map, Ice Beam, 10-5. And they're doing this with uh, with Diesel on the bench, so you gotta feel pretty confident right now. Kuka? Nope. Statue gets him. Clutch spaz shot. Mayhem gets cleaned out by Morvin. Here's another good chance, but both. One nade, two kills. The story of Statue ATX7 pole. Kuka switching to a spaz, trying to get a little speed to his rush. But it might be too little too late. 2 minutes and 22 seconds ago. If that's not good luck, I don't know what is. Statue's got a good flag toss, but no one's there. Pure gets to return. Nice law from Morvan. They're going to have two rush into the base right here. Statue gets the nade kill. He's going to get the flag at full health. This could be a cap. Yep, nice boost. He's gone. He's out. 3-0. to zero. You gotta feel pretty comfortable right now. You got all the med kits out of your base. Gonna make it really hard for Alpha to cap. And you're still putting the pressure on. Mayhem's killed by Foggy. Kuka very weak. Nice knife from Statue. 3-0. to zero. Minute and a half left. Foggy with a nice law. He's gonna throw it to Statue. Statue should be gone. Nice boost. Hits the meds. That's a cap, pure chasing, but a little too, little too late. Kuka, first good chance right here, maybe if they can make a throw. Oh, but Foggy has the flag, we didn't even know. 5-0, to zero. this got out of hand quick. Don't let the score deceive you, this was a lot closer than it looked. Take a look at the score really quick. They really pulled away in the DMs late. Kuka, though. Hey, there's the cap. Get a little momentum going into Wretch. Fifty seconds left. A commanding five to one lead for Poland number one, which will give them a two map to zero lead heading to the third map, which is their own map, Wretch. Mayhem with the return, not that it's going to do much, 20 seconds left. Morvin with a nice triple kill. And there's our numbers for map number two. All right, map three is Wretch, Poland numero uno, which is the Bravo team. Morvin, Statue, and Foggy have a two map to zero lead, so a tie here will end it for them. The Alpha team with Pure Mayhem and TBD needs a win here to keep it going. And the map will be Wretch. CTF Wretch. What a fun little map. Kuka coming back in, so it is another Oxid lineup. Diesel gonna stay on the bench, so it's Foggy, Statue, Morvin. Same lineup as last map, pretty much. Nope, oh, Mayhem's going to spec. Horn's coming in. Okay, 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 okay. So you'll have Foggy top, Statue being very fast, low, Morvin being the defender and the flag booster for Bravo. Alpha, we'll see what we see. All right, all right, all right, here we go. Kuka, Kuka, Kuka's gonna spaz boost top. Pierre's gonna use spaz top also. This is definitely a spaz map if you can handle it. Morvin with the first kill low. He's gonna come into base, but he's very weak. Foggy coming in full though. Good rush chance, actually. And the first cap for Morvin. Flag toss from Foggy. Nice team. Offense. And now Morvin's coming in top, fast mid. 
But Foggy is back up. So they have a good chance here if Morgan can take care of him. But here comes Statue. Oh, he's weak and he gets taken care of. Foggy cleans him out. Horn. Here comes Foggy again, takes care of Kuka, but he's going to return to base, or at least step back a nice law shot on Pier. Kuka having to turn for Foggy, who's just kind of disrupting everything from above right now. And Foggy kills him again. Oh, he doesn't get the health kit, though. Good chance for Pier here to kind of switch momentum. Kuka with a nice double kill is going to lead the flag. He has a chance to throw it. No, nice knife from Statue. Clutched. And a double kill. He's going to still come in top. Statue coming in quick. See if he can get the flag throw off. Nope, he's actually going to just settle it nicely for the Alpha team. 1-0 here, two minutes in. Kuka. Black chance? Nope. It gets sandwiched. Statue, he's out. He's lightning fast, gets the return, gets the cap. Bada bing, bada boom, I want you in my room, because that turned me on. Alright, 2-0. to zero. Horn clears the base, Foggy coming in from above. And Statue coming in from above. Gets one, not the other. Kuka coming in fast, he's going to look... Try to get the health kits, and he does. Two top rush right here. Pierre gets taken care of Morvan, though. Statue gonna cut top. Very weak. Gets cleared by Pierre. Foggy has a chance here. No one in base. He's gonna get the flag. Kuka turning, but he's very weak. Oh, what's Foggy going for? Oh, interesting. Interesting. It does not work. And a cap. Oh, hey, look at this. Two to one. We have life. Three minutes into the match, it is now two to one in per favor of Poland number one. Statue weak, should get killed by Horn. You just never know. Kuka gonna go back and get health. Foggy coming in hot top now. But nothing doing. Here comes Statue quick again, but Kuka takes care of him with a nice two shot spaz kill. Alpha getting a little more cohesiveness, rushing a little better together now. Pier kills one, but Foggy's going to come in from above, gets the kill, has a chance to rush in. Alpha flag in a tough spot, though. Statue weak. Pier's going to kill him. Kuka looking for health, and he gets it. He gets it, he stays alive. This is a good rush chance. Horn. If he can get the... Oh, he doesn't. Nice nays from Mormon. Just let him put him in his feet. Foggy the nice knife on Kuka to clear the base. And we're still 2-1, to one, folks. Remember, Alpha Squad needs a win here to keep the match going. Pier very weak, but a nice... Oh, Horn gets the kill. Kuka. Kuka, he's very weak. See if he gets the flag toss. Oh, he doesn't need a flag toss. He does it on his own. 2-2. Two to two. Lightning fast. Some nice plays by the Spaz Boys on this map. Five and a half minutes left. Still plenty of time on Wretch. You know how crazy this map is. Statue's gonna get the flag as a chance to throw it. Nope, he's not gonna throw it. He's. Oh my god, he's a madman. And he. Oh, come on. Okay. That would have been a gross one. Flag's gonna fall low, though. Alpha's gonna get the return. Yep. Oof. Horn, horn. Nice flag throw. Is there anyone there? Is there anyone there? Pier? Statue? Ooh, Statue gets the return and the double kill. And he might get the flag right here. Nice knife from Kuka to take care of him, though. Morvan very weak. Also gets killed by Kuka. Pier kills himself, so Foggy will come in full health top. But Kuka's doing a good job of defending and really slowing him down right now. The momentum's definitely flipped a little bit to the alpha side. We'll see if they can ride that momentum and maybe get a cap to take the lead. Morvin has to go. Oh, Horn has a good chance right here. If he can get the flag. Oh, he misses the flag. Oh, baby, what is you doing? But Pierce still alive. Pierce very weak. No! Nice shot. 
Kuka, Kuka, Kuka. Oh, a good return from statue, but Horn's still in the base and he missed the flag again. Oh, honey. All right, he's back. He's still here. Causing a little chaos, Morvan clears him out. That was a golden opportunity that uh, just kind of fell through the fingertips there. We'll see if they regret that one later. Pierre's going to get cleaned out by Morvan as well. Foggy's got the flag. That should be a cap. Everyone's dead. Death from above and a cap for Poland number one. Three minutes and 45 seconds left. That's a 3-2 to two lead now. Foggy with a nice knife, and this could be another cap. Mormon? Mormon is so weak. But he's got his whole team right there. Horn, nice move to get out. Oh, he kills Statue. Oh no, the flag! Oh, that was unfortunate. That could have been a counter cap. 3-2 to two now. Nice clear from Poland 1. Foggy's going to come in pretty full here, and Kuka's very weak. Nope, he's going to retreat to health. Pier kills him. Statue coming out of the top rush. And he's very weak, but he has a chance to get the flag. There's no one else here. Oh, nice turn from Horn to kill him. Good communications there. Foggy. Horn still in the right spot at the right time. And Bravo cleans out everyone. They will now have a nice chance to counterattack. Two top again. Statue coming in top with the spaz, which is always dangerous. Still alive. Morvin gets a nade. Nade boosts himself. Okay, that could be a cap. Nice boost. And 4-2. to two. That's huge. Two and a half minutes to go. Feels like maybe the game, but you never know. Alpha's going to need three caps here to keep it going since they need a win here on the third map. With the Bravo team, a.k.a. Poland number one, a.k.a. Impure Minds and IA Combo Squad Gang Gang won the first two maps. Pierre takes care of Foggy. Misses the health pack though, that seems like it could be a big play. And gets cleaned out by Morvan. Oh, statue, nice throw, but not enough. Kuka's gonna return it. Kuka, nice play! Oh, but Foggy's still alive. Here's a good chance. Nope. Nice clever from Foggy from above. They're definitely holding strong on that top route, sending two right at two top at the right time, making big plays. Pierre though, gonna be coming in full health. Nope. The knife is left wanting. Morvan with a nice double kill. In the meantime, Statue's got the flag, full health, just low, just dancing. Just dancing. Nice flag throw to Foggy. Foggy's gonna clean him out. Kuka, Kuka, Kuka. It's going to be a cap. 5-2. to two. It was close for a while, but they're pulling away late. Statue coming in again. Very weak. Kuka's going to kill him. Peter gets taken out by Foggy. Just a really solid uh, performance. Very few mistakes from Poland 1. Peter with the kill. He's going to go low, Morvan turns, gets the kill to clear it and return it. We're down to the last minute, 50 seconds left. I will say this one is probably over. Nice flag throw, but Horns? Nah, he's so weak. Morvan gets the double kill and the return. Morvan going big this match. I think, uh, depending on how this ends, he could go 50 plus kills on all three maps. Here comes Horn. Morvan tries a nice little cheeky knife, but it gets shut down. Foggy and Pierre both knife each other, it looked like, and neither one got killed. Just sold at things, boys. We're used to it around here. Foggy, still, <laughs> oh my gosh. We can, you can just laugh at that one. Six to two. Ten seconds to go. Don't quote me on this, but I believe both teams are still alive, as there's a three Poland matchup, so I'm assuming each team plays each other once. But all in all, that was a good game. Pulling one with the 3-0 victory. Well, Colt, what are your thoughts? Well, I'd like to say uh, it was a hard-fought match. Everyone came out and played their best. I'm going to have to give that MVP to Morvin, who was just a solid killer and really never uh, had any weaknesses. Just played an all-around really good match. Combined with his longtime teammate Statue's rushing abilities, you know, he's, that's what you see. You see a 3-0 win, and uh, we'll see what happens from there.